Find the standard equation of the hyperbola which satisfies the given conditions. The foci is at negative 7, se negative 17, and negative 7, 17. The absolute value of the difference of the distance of any point from the foci is 24. So, plot muna natin para makita natin ano isura ng problem. So, let's graph. Sorry. Okay. So, the foci nasa negative 7, negative 17. So, that's negative 7. So, let's have this as negative 7. And then negative 17. So, let's have here negative 17. Negative 17. This is one of the foci. And the other one is at negative 7, positive 17. Positive 17. So, Let's have here, positive 17. Okay. Which means, ang ating hyperbola, ang axis niya ay vertical. So, the axis, sorry, axis is vertical. May ibig sabihin, ang equation natin is y squared over a squared Ay, sorry. Di pala. Di pa pala alam ko nasa ng gitna. So, if the foci is at negative 7, negative 17, negative 7, 17. So, ano yung nasa gitna nila? So, the midpoint of these two points, this one and this one, is actually this. This is at negative 7, 0. So, the midpoint is at negative 7, 0. This is the, this is your H and K. So, di pala ito. Sorry. Actually, yon na nawala lang yung h at k. So, if the, if the if your axis is vertical, so you have y minus k squared over a squared minus x minus h squared over b squared is equal to one. So since we already have the value of the values of h and k, so we can substitute na. So since zero naman yung k mo, so we have y squared over a squared minus x minus so minus minus so it will become plus seven squared over b squared is equal to one. Now we don't have a value the the values of a and b. Pero alam natin from the problem that the absolute value of the difference, take note from the difference of the distances of any point from the foci is 24. By definition, that is 2a. So you can review your definition of hyperbola. Diba sabi sa hyperbola? Um, is the set of points ng distance nila from two fixed points, foci, yung difference known is constant. So we have, and it's equivalent to 2a, sabi dun sa uh, isang lemma ng, uh, ng theorem about hyperbola, or ng definition about hyperbola. So we have 2a, 2a is equal to 24. So we have, uh, divide everything by 2. So we have a is equal to 24 over 2, it's 12. So we have a value for A. We have 12. Now, how about B? Actually, yung B yung paganta, di ba? Dito, tsaka sa kabila. Conjugate. Yung dulo ng conjugate axis. But we don't have uh, uh, the length of the conjugate axis. But we have the value of the focal distance. It's from the center to one of the foci. And it is 17 units. So we have C is equal to 17. Isa ulit lemma for hyperbola. We know that C squared is equal to A squared plus B squared. Uh, therefore, we have 17 squared is equal to 12 squared plus now. So we can solve for B. So we have 17, so B squared is equal to 17 
minus, so 17 squared minus 12 squared. So, actually, painting, this is a difference of two squares. Tama? So, we can have 5 times 17 plus 12. That's 29. 29 times 5. Uh, 45, 4, 5 times 2, 10, uh, plus 4, 145. Tama ba? 17 minus 12 is 5. 17 plus 12 is 29. 5 times 9 is 45. 5 times 2 is 10, 145. So therefore, V squared is equal to 145. Pwede natin hindi kuhanin si B. Kasi we just need the equation. Therefore, our equation... Uh, now becomes, so, well, paano ko ba isusulat? Papatan natin yung B, di ba? Dito na lang sa space na to. So, yan. So, we have Y squared over A squared. A is 12. So, 12 squared is 144. Minus X plus 7 squared over your B squared, na-compute natin siya, it's 145. 45 is equal to 1. So, this is the equation of your hyperbola with, what are the conditions again? Foci, negative 17, negative 7, negative 7, negative 17, negative 7, 17, and the absolute value of the difference of the distance of any point from the foci is 24. So, actually, yung turning point done is knowing this. The absolute value of the distances of any point is 24.